Ethalia. As we mentioned, April is National Child Abuse Prevention Month, and today children in crisis received a very heartwarming gift. Desert Outreach Foundation distributed 500 teddy bears to local organizations that help child abuse victims. Dozens of teddy bears were passed out this afternoon at the Cathedral City Fire Department station on Desert Vista Road. They're used as a tool because uh, you've got kids who have been abused or, or maybe they're in a, a traumatic situation in terms of being in a hospital or here at the fire department, maybe there's a fire. And that relaxes the child, it's something for them to hold on to. Uh, it just it brings a smile to a child who is in a difficult situation. And uh, all the organizations tell us uh, how important they are. Teddy bears will also be passed out to children Monday at Desert Regional Medical Center in Palm Springs. The Digicom Film Festival kicks off May 1st in Palm Springs. It's a student film festival that celebrates students, teachers, and community stories from Palm Springs Unified School District. The film festival launched in 2009, and this year's theme is Imagine. Films will reflect creative and inventive, as well as triumphant stories of the human spirit. Cathedral City High School digital arts students worked collaboratively with Rio Vista Elementary School students and members of our local artist community to create a charming original illustrated video storybook written by a third grader. So we have everything from kindergartners imagining their superpowers to uh, Zombies taking over one of our high schools and where all the students got involved in that project to a wonderful project from a um, collaborative project that was done from, with Rio Vista Elementary School and Cathedral City High School students. Digicom is funded totally by community sponsors. This year's sponsors include the City of Palm Springs, Palm Springs Disposal Services, Digicom Community Partners, and the Pinnacle Fund. The Digicom Film Festival is set for May 1st at Palm Springs High School Auditorium. The event is free and open to the public. For more information, log on to our website, KMIR6.com. This is the last weekend for residents of Rancho Mirage to donate extra citrus fruit to a Valley Food Bank. Extra fruit like grapefruits, oranges, and lemons benefit the Hidden Harvest Food Bank. The agency provides food to the hungry right here in the Valley. Residents can drop off their fruit at Rancho Mirage City Hall through Sunday through April 15th. Rancho Mirage has collected nearly 23 pounds of fruit to benefit the less fortunate here in the Valley, hoping to collect much more. And still to come tonight on your KMIR 6 News at 5. The latest on a wet and wild rescue of a wayward dolphin right here in Southern California. And prosecutors are asking a Florida judge to raise the bond for George Zimmerman, the man charged in the death of 17-year-old Trayvon Martin in Sanford, Florida. And we want you to be part of the KMIR 6 News Team. If you see breaking news or you have a story idea, give us a call into our newsroom. That number is 760-340-1623. On KMIR 6 News at 6. Parents swaddling their babies. Never instructed me on a proper way to swaddle her. Will develop a dislocated hip. The hip is not going to grow normally. How the wrong way could be putting your child at risk. On KMIR 6 News at 6. I just wanted to say a few words. First of all, thank you for the lovely meal, Jane. Mom. And let's hear it for Sarah's paper mache Eiffel Tower. It's the Washington Monument. And Dad, I'll never forget what you said to me this morning. You said... Brian, it's 11.15. Get up. So maybe this is just the cake talking, but let's celebrate. Celebrate the little things. Buy any KFC 10-piece meal or larger and get a free double chocolate chip cake. What's with the shirt, Dad? What? I always wear a blue shirt to work. It's big. Yeah, to promote the really big sales events. We're helping people not have to settle for a Honda wannabe. They can lease a new Civic LX for only $179 a month. And because it's a Honda, it's really fuel efficient. All the guys are wearing them. Dad, if all the guys jumped off a bridge, would you? It's just till April 29th. We love gardening. Yeah, but the feeling wasn't always mutual. I want you to grow big. If you grow for me, you get cookies for free. Nothing worked. But we started using miracle Grow garden soil. You just mix it with your backyard soil, and it feeds your plants for up to three months. My plants grew bigger, more beautiful, with more flowers and vegetables guaranteed. Everything changed with miracle Grow. For you are these flowers. Like soap is for showers. Everyone grows with miracle Grow. Spice up your living room now with great deals every single day at Mathis Brothers Furniture. 
Go contemporary with this unique platform-based design with button-tough seating, only $689. Check out this track arm style sofa with durable performance fabric and matching pillows, just $491. We simply have it all at Mathis Brothers and in every style or design you could want. So bring your measurements and meet with our pro design team for a full makeover and start saving with the largest furniture outlet in California, Mathis Brothers. If you've been injured in an accident, call me, Sebastian Gibson at 855-WHAT-NOW. Don't let an accident ruin your life. Call 855-WHAT-NOW. The news is brought to you by DCS Air Conditioning. Fixed right or it's free. Space Shuttle Enterprise has arrived in New York City. The Enterprise left Dulles, Virginia this morning on the back of a 747 Boeing jet. Once it arrived in New York, it flew over various landmarks, including the Statue of Liberty, Ground Zero, and the George Washington Bridge, among other things. The retired shuttle landed at JFK International <laughs> Airport, where, where it'll stay until June, when it'll be moved by barge to its new home at the Intrepid Sea, Air, and Space Museum in Manhattan. In tonight's Pacific Premier Bank stock market close, a day of gains to close out the trading week on Wall Street. The Dow jumped 23 points, NASDAQ added 18, and the S&P 500 gained 3 points. A bill keeping student interest loan rates from doubling passed the House of Representatives today. The yeas are 215 and the nays are 195. The, the House passed... The House passed the Interest Rate Reduction Act with a 215 to 195 vote led by GOP lawmakers who ignored a White House veto threat on the measure. The White House and most Democrats opposed the $5.9 billion bill because the way Republicans cover its costs by taking funds from preventive programs and a President Obama's health care law. The bill now heads to the Senate where it is expected to be ignored. The Democrat-controlled Senate is likely to pass their own version. The criminal trial against former Democratic presidential candidate John Edwards continues as his ex-aide Andrew Young took the stand for the fifth straight day. Now Young testified that he felt in danger during a 2008 meeting on a back road where he asked Edwards to tell him the truth about his mistress, mistress Riel Hunter. The lawyer also debated whether a sex tape of Edwards and Hunter as well as allegations of an extramarital affair involving Young could be entered as evidence. U.S. District Court Judge Catherine Eagle said she would rule later today on whether the sex tape would be admissible. Edwards has not or has pled not guilty to six counts of campaign finance violations. He could spend up to 30 years in jail if convicted. A Florida judge is not forcing George Zimmerman to hand over his website donations of over $200,000. Zimmerman is charged with second-degree murder on the death of 17-year-old Trayvon Martin. Zimmerman's attorney says his client did not disclose the contributions at his bond hearing last week. At a hearing this morning in Sanford, prosecutors asked the judge to consider raising Zimmerman's $150,000 bond. The judge says he needs to find out more about the account before ruling. Zimmerman was not at the hearing this morning. He was released from jail last Monday. And crews spent the day trying to rescue a wayward dolphin spotted in Southern California's Bolsa Chica wetlands in Huntington Beach. The dolphin was seen swimming in circles in shallow waters. A spokesperson for the State Department of Fish and Game says the animal appears stressed and disoriented. Officials suspect the animal swam underneath a bridge and became separated from its pod swimming in nearby Huntington Harbor. Rescue teams tried to coax the dolphin out of the bay, but that didn't work, so they're waiting for a high tide to arrive, which will hopefully get that wayward dolphin back out of the bay and back in to the ocean. Brian Schofield joins us after the break with a look at your full lifestyle forecast. That and much more still to come on your KMIR 6 News at 5. The Stagecoach Country Music Festival, one of the biggest events in the Valley, and it's all thanks to this man. NDO's been amazing. Tonight at 11, meet the force behind the music, an exclusive interview with AEG Live President and CEO Randy Phillips. Tonight on KMIR 6 News at 11. Coming this May, The Voice crowns another champion, and Smash belts out a winning season finale. More exclusive stories. Stories to save you money and protect you from scams. This May, we're KMIR 6 News right here, right now. Calling all vampire chasing cooking show fanatics. Enjoy all the things you love better with Time Warner Cable. Never miss a minute of your favorite shows, even if you forget to set your DVR and say goodbye to buffering. 
Call 866-676-3799 for packages as low as $89.99 a month. Plus, get DVR service free for one year. And we'll boost your internet speed free for six months. Time Warner Cable. It happens only once a year. The spring one day sale. This Saturday at Banner Mattress. Save 25, 35, 45. Up to 50% off your favorite brand name mattresses. Queen set started $299. And with interest free financing up to four years, you can step up to a premium mattress for around a dollar a day. From our showroom to your bedroom with free same day delivery. Saturday with special preview day Friday. Meet the next step in your green routine. Solar water heating, a companion system that captures the warmth of the sun to help your current water heater use less energy. It's an environmentally friendly improvement to your home or business. Solar water heating, the next step in your green routine. Rebates are available through the California Solar Initiative Thermal Program. Learn more at waterheatedbythesun.com. This spring at Spa Resort Casino, it's out with the old and in with the heart-stopping, one-of-a-kind dream machine you deserve to drive. The Mercedes-Benz C250. Now through June 3rd, two of these amazing sports sedans plus thousands in cash are up for grabs in the Cash in Class Mercedes Giveaway. Paradise Rewards Club members get free entries every day and earn more when they play. That's two big drawing days, May 20th and June 3rd, only at Spa Resort Casino. The big winners are downtown. This portion of KMIR 6 News is brought to you by Hammer Plumbing. Problem solved. Right here, right now. This is your lifestyle weather forecast. Welcome back, TGIF. The weekend has finally arrived and temperatures are on their way out. Well, it's sort of arrived. Well, yeah, we got a few more hours. Yeah, for, for everybody us. else, it's <laughs> meteorologist Brian Schofield standing by now with your weekend forecast. Hey, Brian. Gino Elizabeth, let me drop a little weather knowledge your way once again on this day. 2004 Idlewild uh, tied the all time April record at 85. And here's the more interesting part they did it again the very next day. <laughs> and well, they did it way in the past too, but just more recently. Very interesting. Two days in a row breaking the same record. Oh, I love that. Anyway, uh, taking a look at high pressure on board, how can you tell? All that clearing usually, usually means high pressure is in the vicinity. It's what kept the winds going for a little bit longer, but certainly things look really good right now. That means all the mess will stay to the north. Uh, we got some good showers. Now we're drying things out in anticipation of a very dry weekend with the jet so far to the north. That means 90s high pressure builds back in again. So really everything's nice. Well, actually, it's been building in, but it really gets strong for the weekend and we start to see the temperatures start to climb once again. So overnight lows right there, uh, eastern ends of the valley will say upper 50s, uh, western ends probably in the lower 60s. I see some nice numbers for the high deserts, rather crisp in the 50s through the pass as well. 90s for tomorrow, oh, yeah, it's certainly that's a warm one, but we've already been warmer this year, so these are some nice numbers to see. Nice is the good word. And uh, what is it, La Quinta hits 30 for tomorrow. They have a 30th birthday there. <laughs> that's pretty cool for a community. I'll tell you that. La Quinta, just another beautiful area. So uh, that's going to be fun. They're going to have a big event there. But uh, either way, I think we're going to look good. Next few days thereafter, we're going to warm things up just a little bit, but generally middle to upper 90s. I don't see 100s just yet. Most areas not hitting that just yet. All right. Gino, Elizabeth. All right, thanks, Brian. A day of damage assessment and cleanup following a series of rare nighttime tornadoes that ripped through so uh, southeastern Colorado. At least five homes were destroyed in the early hours this morning after as many as three twisters tore through several counties on the Colorado Plains. Rooftops were blown off, homes, walls were splintered, and only debris left to rummage through. The force of the winds were so severe, a tractor trailer was picked up and toppled over on the highway. Only two minor injuries were reported, though, thankfully, in this rare nighttime mm. tornado. That's the scariest of all tornadoes, right. and they're all pretty scary. Sleep right through. Look at that damage. Yeah. Amazing. Ahead tonight at 5, a higher wire rescue, a high wire rescue involving a fearless feline, and it's all caught on tape. Summer at the movies is about to heat up, so which films should you see? I'm Manny the Movie Guy. I'll let you know. Coming up. You shouldn't have to empty your wallet to fill your tank. 
Nissan makes seven models that get over 30 miles per gallon. And Nissan is the first company with a car that uses no gas at all. Hang on to more of your money. Right now, save up to $31.50 on Nissan Altima. Visit ChooseNissan.com. Test drive at your local Nissan dealer today. More people choose Ashley Furniture Home Store. Free the discount everyone understands at Ashley Furniture Home Store's Choose Your Style free event. Get a Harmony five-piece bedroom, just $5.99, or this Zia five-piece living room, only $7.99, plus free items store-wide with qualifying purchases, like purchase a five-piece living room and get a matching recliner or chair absolutely free. Hurry in, ends Monday at Ashley Furniture Home Store, now open in Laguna Hills. Visit any of our 13 convenient locations. Snowbirds, golfers, the exclusive Dunes Club is now offering a unique Snowbird golf ownership. Combining luxurious accommodation and a country club membership. Stay for the whole season or just the portion of your choice and play golf every day on a PGA course without green fees. Designed for the realities of desert living, you pay only for the time you are here. This is the guaranteed best value in the desert. Call or stop by while our founding owner pricing is still in effect. There are a limited number of these residences available. Why come to Executive Wellness? I went from a size 12 to a size 6 in four weeks. Thank you, Executive Wellness. I went from 185 pounds to 168, and I lost a waist size from 34 to a 30. It was great. I went from a size 8 to size 2 in less than a month. And if anyone's looking to lose weight and looking fabulous, I highly recommend Executive Wellness. You can reach your goal in as little as one month. Call us today. We survived. We are together. We did it. His father fought an international battle to bring him home. He's a super dad. <laughs> now Sean Goldman tells his story for the first time. It's incredible. A Dateline exclusive tonight on NBC. This portion of KMIR 6 News is brought to you by the Living Desert Zoo, a zoo adventure like no other. Open daily. Welcome back. Summer is just right around the corner and our trip to the movies is about to heat up. From big blockbusters to expensive sequels, many of the movie guy gives us a preview of the summer box office. Hello movie buffs, Marvel's The Avengers flies into theaters on May 4th and that's the beginning of our summer at the movies. So what other films should you go see? Save the dates! Here it goes. On May 11th, the quirky and campy Dark Shadows. No one can do quirky and campy better than Johnny Depp and director Tim Burton. Also on May 11th, All Hail the Dictator. I can't wait to see this movie. Then, Battleship Docks on May 18th. On May 25th, Men in Black 3 invades theaters. Then on June 1st, Snow White and the Huntsman. This is a darker take on the Snow White fairy tale starring Twilight's Kristen Stewart. But not to be outdone is Robert Pattinson in his new erotic drama, Bellamy, arriving June 8th. Also on June 8th, Madagascar 3, Europe's Most Wanted. But wait, Prometheus also opens on June 8th. This is the alien prequel we're all waiting to see. Then on June 15th, Rock Out with Tom Cruise in Rock of Ages. Then on June 22nd, Abraham Lincoln, Vampire Hunter. Also on June 22nd, Pixar's first female-centric film, Brave. Then on June 29th, G.I. Joe, Retaliation. Also on June 29th, Channing Tatum and Matthew McConaughey take it all off in the male stripper drama Magic Mike from acclaimed director Steven Soderbergh. And just in time for 4th of July, The Amazing Spider-Man. Yup, the reboot. And on July 13th, Ice Age Continental Drift, the fourth film of the popular franchise. Then on July 20th, the movie that I'm really looking forward to seeing, The Dark Knight Rises, the third and final chapter of the Batman saga from director Christopher Nolan. Then The Bourne Legacy opens on August 3rd. Goodbye Matt Damon, hello Jeremy Renner. Also on August 3rd is Total Recall. Colin Farrell wants us to forget the original movie starring Arnold Schwarzenegger. Then on August 10th, Hope Springs. Meryl Streep returns with her The Devil Wears Prada director for this dramedy. August 17th offers The Expendables 2. Double the testosterone, double the action. Also on August 17th, the animated Paranorman, where the boy sees dead people. 
And finally, Whitney Houston's last film, Sparkle, opens on August 17th. Yup, we will always love her. So there you have it, movie buffs. I'll be locked up in theaters, swimming in popcorn this summer. I'm Manny the Movie Guy, popping out. Time now for check what's coming up all new on the KMIR 6 News at 6. Swaddling can be a dream for parents trying to sue the fussy baby. But as with most things, there's a right way and a wrong way to swaddle your child. We'll tell you what that is. Plus, jackpot alert. Tonight's Mega Millions has hit $88 million. So all of a sudden, it's worth making a trip to the store. Those stories and more coming up tonight at 6. You going to try again? You better believe it. Okay. Keep trying until I win it. Still to come on your KMIR 6 News at 5. A cat is stuck up sky high near some high powered voltage or high voltage power lines. Video you've got to see next. Coming up this Friday night, late new guidelines just issued for the Secret Service. How their agents should behave on the road. We'll have the story out of the White House here tonight. Tonight, there are only four all-new episodes left of Grimm this season. I think I need to send him a message. And we're saving the beast for last. Thank Grimm, it's Friday. All new tonight on NBC. Monday, the final eight perform live, and their fate is in your hands. All you need is that voice. It's a star-studded event you don't want to miss. It's going to be a mega moment. The Voice Live semifinals, Monday and Tuesday here on NBC. Introducing Super Sunday Spectacular. Four Sundays in April, Spotlight 29 is giving away four GMC Sierras and over 30 grand in cash. Join Club 29 to earn entries and earn more when you play. Then be at Spotlight every Sunday starting April 8th to win. It's a guaranteed $1,000 in cash every hour from noon till 6 p.m. Plus the GMC Sierra giveaway at 7 p.m. every Sunday. Super Sunday Spectacular. Spotlight 29 Casino, the Valley's best bet. I just wanted to say a few words. Thank you for the lovely meal, Jane. Mom. And maybe this is just the cake talking, but let's celebrate. Buy any KFC 10-piece meal or larger and get a free double check.